Don't forget to like and subscribe to Jolie Knott's Crochet. Share with your friends. Hit that little notification bell so you can get notified when new patterns release. All our videos are available in left and right-handed tutorials. Hi everyone, I'm Crystal. Welcome back to Jolie Knott's Crochet. Today I'm going to teach you how to make a center pool ball with all of the yarn that you frogged so you don't have to roll it up and cut the ends. Once you've frogged from one project and your yarn is still attached, you don't want to cut those ends, you don't want your ball to be getting all tangled. So the way we're going to do that so the way we're going to do that is we're going to take our yarn that's attached to the project. That's the yarn we're going to take down our hand. Now the yarn attached to the ball and to your frogged yarn, you're going to hold it to come down your hand and then you're going to start wrapping the yarn loosely around your finger. A few times and then we're going to cross it. I'm going to cross it going up, we're going to cross it going down, and we're going to do it just like that, just like we would a ball of yarn, only instead we're doing it around our fingers. Now make sure you're wrapping it loosely because you don't want to, of course, cut off the circulation of your hands. We also don't want our yarn to be too tight, otherwise our yarn stretches out. So we're just going to keep doing this over and over and over. So now when you get to where the yarn is attached to the ball, all you need to do is remove your fingers and now you've got this center pull yarn ball that you can just sit right next to your skein and continue working on your project without needing to get your yarn all tangled up after you've frogged it. Alright everybody, for more crochet hacks, go ahead and take a look at the description below. And I will see you next time.